Um, so today we'll be styling few set and legend. So this is a few set and legend type. So we learned this in HTML already. So if you want to check out the video, check in the description. So yeah, I've made a form. So also how I made this form is in the description. So you can check it out. So we'll be styling the few set and the legend element. So I'm using the type selector here. So here is the, the body as the background we did in, in the last class. As on gradient. Let me check it out also. This is the gradient we made in the last class. So if you want to know how I made this gradient, you can check out the video in the description. So the video of the gradient in the description. So let's move back to our to our lesson. Yeah. So go back to our CSS file now. So on the few set now. I'm going to add the background color to it, so we we'll make it blend with the background. So we we'll give it an, a color of orange. We'll give it a color of orange. Then we we'll set the width, the width to 280 pixels, which I have which I have measured. So 20 pixels. So we want to check this in the web browser. You can see that. So uh, that is okay for it. So that is 280. So next, we we'll set the next property as the border. So we have one pixel solid border. So we add the color, we give the color a color of yellow. So we we'll check that out. So you can see that. So you can see it's blending with the background now. So we we'll set the border radius. We we'll add the border radius to it. So we we'll set where it as 10 pixels. So 10 pixels. So you can you can see that. So you can see the curve edge. So that's border radius work. So next, we add the padding. We add the padding. That is the space between the, the text and the body of the body of the container. That's 20 pixels. Then we add the margin. So the margin I'm gonna set it to 450. So this place this will place it in the center of the page. Yeah. Center. So actually, when I zoom back in, so this is placed on the center of the page. So you can see that. So now the form is on the center of the page. So remember, I was telling the few set and legend. And so far we've gone we've gone so far well on it so now I've designed the legend now that is the the one in, the one on the border that is this the one in highlighted in blue so legend now so we add the background color first of all so the background color is gonna set to to uh, set it to yellow so after that uh, we set the border we set the border also as one pixels solid also yellow so then we set the border radius so type in the border radius as 10 pixels so uh, you can see that now so it looks a little bit of a little bit stuffy so we we'll add padding to it so this will space it out so adding the padding to it now so you can just make the padding 8 pixels so you can see now so it's looking beautiful now so that is readable so we can also um, put our text text align and text transform property so text align is going to go to the left so it's already there so we add the text transform that is to make it in block yeah that's uppercase so transform we have uppercase so you check on the website so you can see that Oh, so it's looking beautiful now. So this is how you style fish and legend in, in CSS. So thank you for watching. So don't forget to check out the videos I stated in the description. And if you are new, if you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe for more lessons and check out the old lessons. So thank you for watching.